Hey there everyone, welcome back. First off, I just want to say thank you all for your love and support. I found out my channel has been blacklisted slash shadow banned from YouTube. Uh, that's why a lot of my videos you can't find in the search results. People aren't getting notifications. People are leaving comments and they're being removed. As well as the fact that YouTube is slowly removing my subscriber count. As well as demonetizing a lot of my videos and my income literally went from like a certain point let's say out of a 10 now it's down to like a one or a two so my channel is being impacted dramatically and this really sucks so i'm gonna have to reach out to youtube and see if there's anything i can do or based on the videos that i've done it's just my channel is basically done for now so all the love and support I get from all of you, it really means a lot. And if you can, please start sharing my videos. Try to get the word out. Share it on Twitter, anywhere you can. And this video is definitely probably going to get uh, blacklisted as well for what I'm going to cover. So make sure to like it and comment down below to help the algorithm as click that subscribe button and share it with everyone you know. So this was just released in a news article. It says that Neo Cove, Wuhan scientists warn of new coronavirus strain with high death and slash infection rate. That's right. It says that Neo Cove, which was first found in bats in South Africa, have a high death and transmission rate. They're stating that this has a higher transmission rate and one out of three people can die from this new strain of coronavirus. So it goes on to say, New Delhi scientists in Wuhan have warned of a new variant of coronavirus, Neocov, currently circulating in South Africa. The new strain reportedly related to the Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, mers cov According to a report by the Russian news agency Sputnik, Neocov, which was first found in bats in South Africa, have a high death and transmission rate. But Nick, however, claimed that Neocove is not new as in 2012 and 2015 it was discovered in outbreaks in Middle Eastern countries, carrying the potentially combined high mortality rate of MERS Cove, where one in three infected people die on average. That's a huge death rate uh, when you think about it. One in three people infected will die on average. That's insane. That's like way crazier than the strains and variants that are going on right now. It continues to state that and the high transmission rate of the current SARS-CoV-2 coronavirus, Neocov cannot be cured by antibodies nor protein molecules produced by people with respiratory diseases. Holy smoke, so Neocov cannot be cured by antibodies nor protein molecules produced by people with respiratory diseases. So they're basically saying that this is going to be like a super strain. Following the findings, experts from Russian State Virology and Biotechnology Research Center issued a statement and said that the potential risks outlined needed to be studied and probed further. The Vector Research Center is aware of the data obtained by Chinese researchers on the Neocove coronavirus. At the moment, the issue is not the emergence of a new coronavirus capable of actively spreading among humans. It states that this comes after the WHO's technical lead on COVID-19, Maria Van Kerkhove, claimed that Omicron will not be the last variant of the coronavirus and there could be more in the future. This is absolutely insane. This virus is still evolving and changing and we need to change and adjust accordingly. We not have only have to increase the vaccination coverage around the world, but also try and transition out. It will not end with the latest wave of Omicron. It will not be the last variant we speak about, unfortunately, Maria Van Kolkov told BBC in an interview. Other article that I found on the Neocov says, according to researchers from Wuhan University and the Chinese Academy of Sciences Institute of Biophysics, only one mutation is required for the virus to infiltrate human cells. So as of right now, they're stating that it can't, but it won't take long for it to actually mutate and then it can infiltrate humans. The research findings say that the novel coronavirus poses a risk because it binds to ACE2 receptor differently than the cor coronavirus pathogen. As a result, neither antibodies nor protein molecules produced by people uh, with respiratory diseases or who have been immunized can protect against Neocov. What I find interesting is that it says that it can't be transmitted to humans, but it can mutate and be transmitted to humans. But the same article says that the new strain reportedly related to the Middle East Respiratory Syndrome, mers Cove, uh, was actually infecting people that claim that Neocov is not new in 2012 and 2015. It was discovered in outbreaks in Middle Eastern countries, carrying the potentially combined high mortality rate of MERS-CoV. 
So, like, yeah, based on that, like, it's, it's a possibility that this is going to be the new strain that's going to start you know spreading around the world um this is absolutely crazy uh this is what everyone's been kind of fearing that there would be a new type of coronavirus that would end up uh taking over all the other strains and variants and it would have a high transmissible rate as well as a high uh, fatality rate and this is basically the one that we should all be worried about the neo cove so this is a huge concern for everyone, no matter what, what's going on in the world. Uh, this could definitely, you know, impact and change the way of living and everything in the world. Neo Cove ends up mutating or ends up, uh, you know, transmitting into some human somehow, uh, then it's just basically going to be like, you know, the worst case scenario that we've all been fearing since day one since COVID came out. So yeah, this is some crazy news that I came across and I had to share with everyone and kind of warn and give everyone's a heads up because, uh, you know, I tried to do my part in the beginning of when COVID started happening and people thought I was crazy and now look at where we're at. And the worst case scenario is that this ends up mutating and infecting people. And if it's like one out of three people that get it end up uh, dying, then that's going to be a huge impact, like I said, on the world. And a lot of people are end up going to be perishing. And this is going to be truly devastating and sad if this ends up happening. And uh, since all the other coronavirus virus strains are mutating and getting in different variants and stuff, uh, it leads me to believe that it's just a matter of time before this ends up uh, mutating or infecting a person. And then it's just going to cause a whole new wave of devastation across the world please do me a huge favor and like this video share it with everyone you know try to get the word out share it on like every social media i'm actually permanently banned from twitter so if you can share it on twitter with hashtags and stuff it would really help me out a lot uh, my channel is shadow banned so i don't think uh, my videos are going to be seen other than people sharing them with their friends and family so any support that i can get on this channel really truly does mean a lot and i really do appreciate it so i just wanted to warn everyone so if you can do me the huge favor, like this video, comment down below with your thoughts and opinions, and click that subscribe button down below. Because like I said, YouTube's now removing my subscribers, and this just really not only impacts you know my channel, my livelihood, my earnings, but also impacts me personally and it just really sucks because i was hoping that one day that i'd you know reach a hundred thousand subscribers or more get my little youtube award or you know just try to make a living off of youtube and not worry about stuff like others have but unfortunately it seems like because of the content that i make the videos that i cover exposing a lot of things talking about a lot of things my channel is now blacklisted and being impacted and it just really hurts because yeah i'm just trying to help people out educate people and warn others and stuff and a lot of the videos and content creators that end up blowing up getting a huge following making millions of dollars are the ones that are literally just doing stupid stupid videos and stupid content or fake stuff so i don't know if this is the end of this channel and i gotta create a new one or if i gotta like convert to stupid content or what the case may be but i don't know it just really sucks so yeah thank you all for the love and support and uh let's just hope and pray that this doesn't end up mutating or infecting a person and transmitting to others and stay safe god bless you all take care and peace out